developing news here, the LAUSD is investigating racist text messages targeting black and Latino students. The FBI says people across the country received the disturbing messages last week. KTLA's Eric Spellman live in downtown LA with more for us. Eric, good morning. Morning, Frank. Students in 32 different states have reported uh, receiving these racist text messages. The FBI is conducting an investigation to try and figure out who sent them out. Let me show you some examples of what we're talking about. These text messages began appearing uh, on Wednesday, the day after the election, and they make references to slavery and demeaning stereotypes. They read, in part, you've been selected to pick cotton at the nearest plantation. They tell the recipients to pack their belongings and that they'll be picked up by somebody in a van. These hateful messages have been received by black and Hispanic kids in grade school, middle school, high school, and college across the country and here locally in the LA Unified School District, in the Inland Empire, and at Santa Monica High School. We spoke to a student there who says as soon as she got one of these texts, she immediately sent it to her mom. I sent it to our family group chat and I was like, oh my God, like who sent, someone sent me this message and she was like, this is like not okay, this is insane and we need to figure out who did this. One of my children wants to leave the country. Um, he doesn't feel safe here. Um, one of the other, there's a few other people say, well, we're in California, we're okay. We've become too comfortable. We have to remain vigilant. We have to remain alert and we have to also uh, make sure that our children pay attention. Now, LA Unified Superintendent Alberto Carvalho sent out this statement over the weekend. It says, we are aware of the racist and incendiary texts that are being sent to students nationwide, including to some of our students. We unequivocally condemn this hateful and threatening rhetoric. We are investigating this situation. If you receive one of these messages, students and families should contact their school for support. However, some community leaders say they want the school district to do more than just condemn the messages. They want the LA Unified District to beef up security beginning tomorrow since today is a holiday. They want school safety officers to be placed on alert to stop any possible incidents of hate violence targeting black students. So the LA Unified School District uh, with their great concern about protecting students, safeguarding students, now's a good chance. Show a force. Have your security force out there in big numbers with one goal and one goal in mind. We take threats, we take violence, or the potential for that very seriously, and we're going to protect the students. You have a bunch of law enforcement agencies across the country investigating this. We're talking about state attorney general's offices. We're talking about the FBI, school districts, that sort of thing. Some investigators believe that the messages are originating from somewhere overseas. We'll send it back to you.